1.50 a.m. Normally, these are the original floors, but we put down this carpet. Ella's stressing because she feels like she didn't pack enough clothes for college. <laughs> we have a bar of soap. We got ours from the hotel. It really doesn't matter. I might cut it, but then just get a one-sided. It almost makes me want to move into a dorm again. <laughs> almost. Almost. Okay, the stairs. Not the stairs. Oh, wait. Oh. No. Okay, give it a second. Okay, now go. Wait, you have to like. I think, Holy crap, it's on here. I think it needs to restart. Okay, we just arrived. It's the bathroom. And we're waiting for her dorm to like key to work. for moving we've been waiting in the car for an hour ella and i went up but the mover is about to come hi how are you great how are you good so you're gonna be with this next group are you just one vehicle i am just one vehicle. all right so you'll just follow them around the, to the front and they'll unload you up there thank you so yeah, much if you got any questions feel free to ask you guys are doing awesome thank you so these people are gonna come take everything out this is the same company that um waterloo oh, yes. he says he goes all over i know i heard that and they're gonna take it in this little cart and bring it up And we're back in Crosby. Ella's stressing because she feel like she didn't pack enough clothes for college. <laughs> so don't show my drawers. I we just gotta go on a shopping spree, I guess. Seconds. To be clear, there's not much room else room in the suitcases. Could have taken yeah. another suitcase. Okay, anyways, Lindsay's Lindsay's Ella's roommate. She um, left all her stuff there, like, I don't know somewhere tonight and moving in tomorrow morning but we are going to just kind of crank out stuff tonight we're watching the live stream because it's 8 9 so we're hoping 1989 gets announced we're waiting for this cabinet here kind of a long story it was supposed to come but it's probably gonna get figured out maybe and then this is Pretty probably much. our biggest project today. We're covering this in white, but yeah, California overall, it's purchase. pretty good. Basically, there's these drawers. This is a before. Hard to move. We have a bar of soap. We got ours from the hotel. It really doesn't matter. Oh, for sure. Look at that. Wow. One of my favorite things on my college packing list, these S hooks. And then you go like this. Reaction, live reaction. <laughs>
1.50 a.m. But we put this white vinyl on the built-ins. I'm like so tired. We just finished watching the Eras Tour live stream. But it's looking good. We went to Marshall's and we're trying to like decorate these shelves a bit. We got these pretty like gold frames from Marshall's for home goods. This was from Marshall's, kind of random but cute. And two more like bigger gold frames. And Ella got cute like earrings for Rush. Um, I went to Ulta. I got Sunday Riley like sample things that I want to try. My fiber and probiotics because I forgot them at home. My voice is kind of gone because I just finished sorority rush with that being said I created the sorority rush prep course from the sorority sister I put all of my sorority rush tips and tricks in there so that you can feel confident going into rush and find the house for you So if you're rushing make sure to check it out in the link in my bio. Okay, here's an update. It's like probably almost 7 p.m. We got this seven? Cabinet it fits the refrigerator and then the microwave should go there. Okay, everyone here has these I didn't have one in my dorm. It's like very unnecessary, but it's very cute. And then they have um, their little lamp. I'll go through like the whole thing at the end, but this is just, we've gone a long way today. And then we're just doing some final touches on the headboards right now. Her roommate's dad is like putting legs on it or something. This is how the Marshall stuff ended up turning out. Okay, it's our last day. Um, it's early afternoon because we've been like shopping this morning. Got this Ole Miss sister shirt. And I also got cute things for my apartment. So stay tuned for my move and vlog to my apartment. So we're finishing up the last few things. We're trying to figure out the best way to hang the curtains because everything keeps falling. Then Ella printed these prints that Ouch. she made. I'll link her Etsy below, but they're so cute. Where'd you, where'd y'all print them from? Okay. Or she didn't make them on Etsy, but she's selling them on Etsy. Good morning, guys. It's my last day here. Like, I leave at 12. 
But we finished the dorm last night. I'm super excited to show y'all. I'm really tired. I like have not been sleeping that much. Um, it is like 7 a.m. I'm gonna go pick up Ella and her roommate Chick-fil-A. They have like their first day of rush today. It's just like information and stuff. And once they leave, I'm going to show y'all the full room before my mom drives me to Memphis to catch a plane back to Austin. But I am just Okay, we are in the final dorm room. I am going to give y'all a full tour and just basically talk through everything that we've been working on this past week. I don't even know where to start. You walk through these doors. We added this table thing with Ella's prints on top. It has like tea, cleaning supplies. And this is an empty door right now. Um, she has a little trash can here. And then the first like addition to the room, we added these bed skirts that velcro on do you want to tell your tip for the bed skirts the bed skirts are a tablecloth right it's a tablecloth skirt like when you're doing events they sell skirts for event tables that's what that is so it already has the velcro on it they're super super inexpensive it's polyester so it's like not the fanciest but it's it'll wash well if they get makeup on or whatever so you, we just had to hem it cut them and then add Velcro to the thing. So it was all of like a $25 project. And then the excess we put at the top. And it comes like pleated already, which is like the number one thing. What we had to do was again, like hem it, cut it, but then just get a one-sided Velcro because this already came with Velcro on it. So we didn't have to sew Velcro on the skirt. Um, so they both have skirts and then we also, again, covered up the top with the excess, and these are on just little, like, rods. Another thing we did to this, this, y'all saw us put on the white vinyl, just to make it a little less wood brown. Because um, also this just had a ton of just, like, Obviously imperfections. On it. Yeah, it was sticky, and it had a ton of holes in it. Like, honestly, even on this side, like, we didn't cover this, but you can see... Like, it's just, it's not in the best condition. Okay, then this is another one of like the great tips. So people put mirrors behind here. Some people will just buy, what's it called? Like when it's just a slab of mirror. The people get it pre-cut at Oxford Glass, a, a pre-cut mirror. But then at the end of the year, it basically comes off and it goes in the dumpster. Cause it breaks when you take it off. But this mirror is just like a literal like mirror that she bought online that, is the same size and so you can see it has like a trim and everything and then they can take this off and reuse it in their next thing okay so that's like her desk area so then she has a mirror and this is where there honestly is a lot of storage in the room but we got these plastic bins that fit perfectly and kind of labeled them for her. And then in here, we have all of the drawers that we did the stack with. And then there's some books inside that we put up. And then her roommate has the same setup. They have the same desk chair. The room comes with another desk chair, but they put it under the bed because it's not as cute. And then her roommate has the same setup, has kind of a different mirror with storage inside of it. Moving on to the windows, took us a bit to figure out how to hang these curtains but there's four panels just to make it look a little fuller and cover the wall more we got super lucky there was already like screw you're not allowed to screw into the wall but there were already screws in there so whoever broke the rules for us last time helped us out and then we have this trim is ribbon that is like ironed on what did you use to iron the ribbon on you make a lot of noise when i'm filming i'm sorry I'm trying to hide her little notes. Okay, well, you could um, do it after I'm filming. Stitch witchery. So she like basically iron just ironed it on. Oh, yes, and then we hemmed the curtains with the same thing. So we, like, tucked them under, and you iron the thing on. Her roommate has her side table there. And then we're on to the beds and the bed place. So this middle console is this huge thing that literally like everyone has here it's crazy inside it fits the fridge the microwave we have a little trash can and then they have all their little cute snacks and stuff in here so it just hides away like that and then they're able to have like a really nice bedside table 
with these two lamps, the painting. We got this tray at Home Goods the other day. Then there are beds. So everything will be linked below. I think these pillows are so cute. Both of these are from Etsy. And then their headboards are from the container store. There's some little plugs on the side. Um, we had her dad kind of make, they went to Home Depot and got like wood so it would sit up correctly but they look great together and then there's a bed skirt underneath so y'all also saw us put this on but um it just kind of covers everything that's under the bed like there's her old chair and these poof things so their bed is lofted but it kind of makes it hard to get up so these things are just like a good little step stool and they're cute and then they can also be storage so yeah then moving on to her like closet area so she has her little shower caddy on here i'll talk about that in a sec this is her closet. We put command strip hooks inside. Bins up there, her laundry stuff, and then her clothes, and then little shoe pockets. Her hamper's down here, and then we also put like a little doormat inside just to kind of give it like little carpet vibe. Then under the bed skirt, she also has bins of clothes oh and then overall the carpet in the room they ordered like a big carpet from just like a carpet store around here that's what we picked up it was like the huge rug a 9 by 12 um so like normally these are the original floors but we put down this carpet so it's just like a little more cozy and homey and then on top of the carpet we put this rug to make it cuter so they have carpet in their dorm but they know it's like brand new and not gross from however many people have been living here okay her shower caddy this is like best shower caddy you could get she's living in crosby at Ole Miss, so it's an all girls dorm but she has the bathroom i showed you all the bathroom like at the very beginning but this is her shower caddy what's great about this one is it separates so you can take if you're just like going to brush your teeth and not showering you can just take this little one or if you're going to do a full shower you can take the whole thing she has it sitting outside just so it can dry and stuff on this little step stool with her shower shoes next to it she also added like lights under here I'm trying to think what other little like tiny tips do you have anything else? It sounds kind of easy when I just say it all in like five minutes like that. But yeah, she's at a corner room in Crosby. It was so, so fun moving her in. Everyone was so kind. Everyone was so, so sweet. Helpful. And the movers were really nice. Like we pulled up our car and they came and took it all out and brought it up here. And her roommate and her family are so great. And it was just really fun. And I'm so excited for her. It almost makes me want to move into a dorm again. <laughs> almost. Almost. But yeah, thank you for watching. I think I'm going to end it. I don't really know what else I would say. Right? Go on my Instagram. I'm probably going to post pictures. And then also last night, me and my mom were already planning my room. Then I move in next week. Got some inspo from the craziness of Ole Miss storms. And I'm really excited to move into my apartment. But I am heading back to Austin today to go do my own rush stuff and then move in next week. So it was a good little break. And thanks for watching. And I will see you all in my next video. Turn the, turn the chair around. Right? Turn the chair around.